In this video, I'll show you how to stitch these simple French knot cluster flowers. Here's what my final project looks like. I'll also link to a blog post tutorial available on my site and to a PDF version of this pattern in the description of this video. To stitch these flowers, all you need to know are French knots and straight stitches. Once you've drawn a circle for your flower, you can start filling it in with French knots. I'll leave a link to a more thorough French knot tutorial below just in case you need it. For this blue flower, I'm working from the inside and out toward the border of my circle. In the blog post tutorial, I demonstrate that you can also choose to work from the outside in. Which you choose is really just a matter of personal preference. I will say that, in general, I tend to work from the inside out on smaller areas like this and from the outside in on larger areas like the pink and yellow flowers I've already stitched. Again, that's just a personal preference. I'm wrapping my needle three times for the fringe knots toward the center of my flower and as I move toward the edge I'll wrap my needle fewer times. I like doing this because it seems to give the flowers a bit more subtle dimension. It also makes it easier for me to create a crisper line around the border. French knot clusters happen when you stitch French knots right next to each other and you can always bring your needle up through any gaps that you notice later on. I'm going to let the video play at normal real-time speed so you can watch me finish this small flower and once I'm done I'll move on to the stem. The stem for this flower is a simple straight stitch, and you can also add additional straight stitches for leaves if you like. Don't forget to check the description of this video for relevant links and let me know if this was helpful in the comments.